Welcome back to the channel guys, Hood Life, where it is hustle out or die life. Yes, and right now uh, I sit in on San Fernando Hill enjoying the good weather. Uh, perfect, perfect day. And I just sit in here thinking, um, you know to myself, so you want to be a creator, you want to create, you want to be creative. Well, this Wednesday tip is for you. Middle week, big old Wednesday You see, I came from the bottom. Matter of fact, I'm still here making progress each year. Yeah, like Nipsey Hustle, I stay on that marathon grind. I'm not in the game for the money. So it's all fine and great that you want to be a creator. Believe me, I am not stopping you. If you feel it in your heart and you're a creator, go ahead, by all means, create. But for me, being a creator is all fine and great until the pressure of delivering gets to you. So if you subscribed to my channel last week, you would have realized I did not deliver on my Wednesday tip. Uh, so I guess this is the perfect time as well too to say go ahead, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell, be notified every single time I do release uh, a video on my Wednesday tips. Um, but last week I had a technical difficulty with my laptop, some, some issues with it. And in the midst of trying to sort that out, um, it hits me. And again, I'm speaking for myself. Being a creator doesn't mean that you have to deliver or else someone will judge you on not being able to, to deliver. Um, because being able to deliver means uh, keeping a, a couple of things in mind and considering a couple of things. The piece of content that you're putting out, is it meaningful? Is it, is it valuable? Is it entertaining? Do you feel it from the heart? Is it the right appropriate time in, in this life frame or in this time in life, in your life maybe, to deliver the content, to release the content? So these are some of the things I kind of run through in my, in my mind as a creator. And the, and, the, and the by far bottom line thing that, that really tumbles the, the thing over for me, the underlying fact is, do I feel it? Do I feel it? Do I really feel this piece of content? So yeah, last week I came to this very spot. Well, not this very spot. I chose a different scenery. I like, think last week I was like over there somewhere, right? But um, I came to this very spot last week uh, to make and record a video about time management. And um, side note, it's not that uh, I, I, I think time management is not important and should not, uh, you know, be spoken about but like i said today is about being a creator and the things that you should consider so my tip today really again is to just tell my experience and show you and tell you what i learned from it and hopefully whoever enjoys watching these videos and enjoy me putting my my videos together on a wednesday and my small vlogs and showing you some pieces of my life that you will kind of relate and, and learn so we can we can learn from each other, right? Uh, so last week I came uh, and I was making a video about time management and, and whatnot and I would probably redo that video in, in due time. Within doing the video, really, like it, it wasn't feeling good to me. And, um, you know, I was just going through the motion. I, I was just going through because I knew I had to deliver a Wednesday tip. So I finished it, everything, and I, I came home um, ready, to, ready to, um, to edit it and ready to put the stuff together. And then um, I was finishing up a project, and then when I was finishing up that project, uh, something happened to my laptop. I had some issues with it, and I was, I was so upset. I was, I was really upset because I just wanted, I knew I had a, a responsibility, and I knew I, my responsibility was to deliver that Wednesday tip to you guys. And then I, Wednesday came because that was Tuesday and Wednesday, Wednesday came and I was like, you know, I was like, bah. <laughs> I, it's not gonna happen then, basically. But between Wednesday and Thursday now, um, I, I just really, and kinda said to myself, you know, like, maybe it really wasn't meant to, to come out or whatnot because i really wasn't feeling it and like i said these things i consider as a creator when putting out content or whatnot 
do I really feel it from my heart? And I, I didn't feel that, that, that video or whatnot. And I was like, you know what? Sometimes as a creator, uh, you think people would judge you uh, and for not putting out, for, for making promises or um, at least trying to be consistent and put out, you know, content, valuable content, meaningful content, because that's when it hits me. And I, I just don't want to put out um, a content every single Wednesday or, or every time. And it's just, it's out there just to be out there because I have to. Um, it hits me and I go, Chris, like, you know, maybe it really, I really wasn't feeling it from the beginning and you came home, this happened, X, Y, and Z. So maybe it really wasn't meant to, to come out. And I mean, <clears throat> I was trying to figure out. So now before it hits me, I was trying to figure out, I was already trying to figure out, do I put this out to next week? Do I make a next one? What do I do or whatnot? <clears throat> and it's only... It's only again between Wednesday afternoon and Thursday now. It go it, it it goes through my mind and it's like, don't pressure yourself. And being a creator and being a new creator on YouTube as well too, I think this is um one of the perfect times to put out a message. The underlying value in today's video and the tip: if you want to be a creator, don't let them fool you. It is not an easy thing, especially when you have the pressure of delivering to people. But also, don't fool yourself, because if you are a creator, then it should be easy. It should be easy, especially when you just focus, put your mind to it, and you create, and you work on your craft. And that's just, that's just the underlying bottom thing about this video. You want to be a creator? Go ahead create be creative in whatever way you want to express your art and your creativity because i would hate for someone to put a stop to my creativity or my art especially by making these videos and just you know coming on youtube and chilling with all your father a few minutes a day you understand so like always i out and bad hood life one life Hustle out or die life. It's really, really uh, something that everybody, everybody should um, at least put out. Uh, at least an experience where you had to probably deliver and you did not or crumble under pressure as a creator because these things do happen as a creator and if that happened to you as a creator i think this is the perfect time to say go ahead comment that below how or when or did it even happen to you did it, did it just as a creator you just crumble under pressure because it's not the first time again i am i, I was a part musician and there was times i crumbled as well i couldn't deliver any studio because of personal issues in my life and you know i i, I just wasn't feeling the song, you know? so go ahead, comment below if that ever happened to you as a creator. Be honest with yourself. Be honest with yourself. And let's uh, let's let's just show the world that it's okay to to kind of fuck up sometimes. Not a joke. I'm here to live the hood life, hustle a lot die. And if you see me cry, I'm alright tonight. And God, if I fail, Lord, please forgive me. Know that I try. Uh. Young nigga, I'm 30 and I'm self-made I came from nothing, everything I got is mine My life was tough, my hustle mode is full time I'm on the grind, I'm a stand-up type of guy Young nigga, I'm 30 and I'm self-made I came from nothing, now I stay on the grind